Joe, thank you. And catching a great deal is not the only priority on a lot of shoppers minds this morning. Staying safe while shopping tops the list. Now over the last few months, we've not only seen COVID cases go up here in the metro area, but we've also seen crime numbers tick up as well. Now just last week, a man was shot after getting into an argument with a group of men near the Apple store inside Lenox Square Mall. And this was the sixth time shots were fired at the mall in the past year. Mara Sirianni joins us now live from Linux Mall as well, where the mall is planning to not only practice social distancing, but also planning to increase police presence. Good morning, Mara. Hey, peace of mind, increased patrols in and around the mall. That is what APD says, and it really stems from this latest incident. Again, like you mentioned, Francesca at the Apple store, but that is just the latest in a string of shootings and violent crimes. We just took a drive around the mall and right up to the mall, saw some flashing blue lights there. Again, good news for shoppers. They can feel safe when they uh, come out here today in this holiday season. Now, in addition to the shooting earlier this month, police say a man tried to rape a woman near the mall. Um, that was, again, earlier this month, but Atlanta police say while businesses are largely responsible for providing security for their properties, the department does have a role here. Brandon Penna manages nearby Roasters restaurant. He says the crime lately has hit an all time high. Nothing like this has really happened, you know, in the past 30 years. We have been uh, breaking into just got to you know, do what we got to do this year. I mean, <laughs> And if you are headed out to the mall today or this weekend, shoppers, as always, you are encouraged to stay alert, vigilant, aware. Make sure you report any possible crime that you do see here.